Welcome back to Indian Times Daily, the top 10 headlines from India. President Ramnath Kovin and Prime Minister Narendra Modi paid tribute to the victims of the 2611 Mumbai terror attack on its 9th anniversary. 166 Indians and foreigners killed were in the attack allegedly carried out by Pakistan-based LET. Skipper Virat Kohli has recorded the most number of international cricket centuries in a year by a captain. India declared their innings at 610 by 6, taking a massive lead of 405 against Sri Lanka in the second test match on Sunday. Prime Minister Narendra Modi on Sunday said terrorism has become a global threat almost as a daily routine. He called for efforts by all humanitarian forces to defeat it. CJI Deepak Mishra has said that the government and courts are bonded by the principle of the constitutional sovereignty. He stated that the institutions must function with a sense of mutual respect without any claim for supremacy. Finance Minister Arun Jaitley has snubbed Pakistan for supporting terrorism. He said that today the situation is such that whoever becomes the commander of Lashkar knows that he will not survive more than two, three months. Prime Minister Narendra Modi has expressed concern over global warming, but he, however, made no reference to the smog that enveloped New Delhi recently, raising serious environmental and health concerns. Congress leader Shashi Tharoor has said that the new party president will be elected through a free and fair electoral process. He added that the party workers felt a strong connect at a personal level with his vice president Rahul Gandhi. Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal has asked people in Gujarat to vote for any party which they think can defeat the ruling BJP in upcoming assembly elections. A large number of Aam Aadmi Party MLAs from Delhi and Punjab as well as Aam Aadmi Party corporators from Delhi were also present. India has topped the medals chart after claiming five gold medals on the final day of the AIBA World Women's Youth Boxing Championships. India earlier had also won two bronze medals. Manushi Chiller, who broke the 16-year jinx for India at the Miss World pageant last week, received a warm welcome from fans as she arrived in India. Safeguarded by ample security, Manushi managed to rush through the pool of people. Stay tuned to Indian Times Daily as the news from America and Punjab follows.